another day of shopping so we have driven about 200 kilometers to boston and now we are at boston <laughs> i did a lenny yes today and today we are going to look wow. we're at the shopping center to shop i did another lenny <laughs> <laughs> oh well let's see what this place brings we are here at outlet and we are going to the toilet <laughs> stick to marketing what yeah i'll try yeah you will never talk really You're scared lah, you can't go scared on Lenny, everything also scared. Ah, okay, try. I thought you go crossfit, I thought you got core muscles. Ooh. It's really cool. <laughs> Look at the amount of stuff we bought, and that's not even all. There's one more guy that's missing. It's about 5 pm today, and we're starting the day very late at 5 pm because we've been driving the whole day. And uh, yeah, we were actually we drove we drove to the outlet, and then like there's one guy that spent like hours buying stuff. But now we're finally in Boston, so check it out, Boston. So one of the first places that we stopped in Boston is the Boston Chinatown because after spending about a week over in the US we are craving for Asian food so today we shall eat some hot pot You know you're back in a city when you see these sky rats right? They are all over all, every city in the world looking for like leftovers and stuff so this is Boston's uh, version of Central Park I guess there are lots of people walking around here doing leisurely stuff just right by the financial district you can see it's a bunch of people doing leisurely things like jogging sitting down having a picnic pushing their babies around getting some fresh air and uh, yeah pretty much it So coming back to the city, uh, city life, what do you think? Uh, do you prefer the country life or the city life? I like the old stagecoach in the one that we had. I think it's much more quiet. Over here it's very real. Everybody is like... Not uh, very polite. Right? Not very polite. It's a bit rude here. Yeah. So... Culture shock. Culture, yeah, we got a culture shock because like it's so diverse in America that like when we're in the countryside, Everyone was very nice. You walk on the road, people will say good morning, they'll say hi, they'll say nice hair. You know, down here it's like, you ask for the washroom, they were like... <laughs> Everyone's for yeah. himself, I would say. Yeah. Yeah. Every man for himself. Every man for himself, yeah. yeah. So, so like, that's, the, that's the city life, I guess. Correct, correct, correct. So, I, I think I'm very much before the country, right? Our, I mean, even our country is so friendly. Yeah. yeah. So I think like, for travel purposes, I think we prefer to be out in the country. Yeah. But for like work purposes and making money, probably we still need to survive in the city. Stay in the city, I guess. I wouldn't, but I wouldn't stay here, I would say. Yeah, I wouldn't stay here as well. Uh, why, why wouldn't you stay here? The people just seem furious. Uh. Uh, yeah, fast too furious. fast, too furious. A lot of people uh, honking their cars, you yeah. know, very impatient. 
and you can see the mental health issues here you know like yeah. when you're walking on the streets you see a lot of like homeless people and they're probably homeless because of either so a lot of people say drug addiction but i think it's more mental health issues yeah i don't think it's yeah. mental health issue yeah well we could be wrong but that's just our observation okay so we are heading to hot pot now after a long day i guess we are all hungry stick to marketing <laughs> so finally we found a hot pot restaurant and the food looks really really good We are finally done with the hot pot. Okay, so Mr. Lenny, how much was the hot pot? Uh, one hundred twenty-three dollars for four person. Yeah. So, yeah. do you it's, feel happy after eating a hot pot? Yes, it's like actually it's like the same price in Malaysia. Like huh? the day I had serious? I had hot pot with my friends actually, and a uh, four of us we eat around four hundred plus. Oh my god, yeah. so it's about the same price. Wow. So how do you Ooh, feel about the hot pot here? Yeah. It's very good. I think good for. Yeah. Chinese food. It's been a while since we have Chinese food. Yep. Yeah, so I think it's good to have some Chinese food and just look at the hot pot. It's not too bad. For the price in which you're paying, I think it's a pretty good deal. Actually, it's a good deal. Actually, it's a good deal. Okay, so we're going back to the Airbnb. Is it? No, hotel. Hotel. Hotel, and we're going to sleep very early because tomorrow we have to catch a 6 a.m. flight. We've got to be at the airport by like 3 or 4 a.m. So, yeah, that's all for today. It's a very, very short vlog because we didn't do very much today. And, yeah, tomorrow we'll be flying to Minneapolis and catch you guys there.